All right, you guys, we'll pick up. Here's part two. This is where we left off yesterday. Okay, quit drooling. I'm just gonna film. That's all I'm gonna do for you guys. That's all I'm gonna do. Ten dollars for that little flower bouquet. That little black thing. That's cute. Okay, there's an interesting case. Fifty percent off. Anchor Hawking. That would be those. Let's see what we got. Oh, look at this little Eskimo pulling out a fish. At night, you guys know I watch a lot of documentaries. I've watched all the alien stuff that's current. How much is that? $20. That is so cute. And so now I switched over to Life Below Zero. Yes. And there's like 11 seasons that I can watch. So that's why that caught my attention. Fun stuff, huh, you guys? I don't know what to say about it all, but it's like a moral wall bust back there, possibly. Acrylic paperweight, $20 from Colorado Souvenir. It's got gold flecks in it, and it's got like minor stuff in it. You know, we've got, there was a gold rush here, too. See, lots of these have coins and rocks. Hey, there's another. Okay, Labradorite. Look how pretty that chunk is. Forty dollars. See the how it iridizes. Okay, we've got more jewelry. I'm bypassing the drawer because I'm getting an itchy wallet finger. As I stop and look at it anyways, no. It's too dangerous right now. Alright. Now yeah, here's something a little different. We've got a faux squash blossom. I have some already holding a place for me. And they are safety pin art squash blossoms. I love that. Some horse hair pottery. Now we're seeing some things. Ice Med, all four for $35. Not even sure what I'm looking at there. And I don't know enough about this kind of stuff to know if, you know, if it's authentic or repops for, you know, the souvenir trade, the tourist trade. But I might be in trouble again. Look at this beaded Jaguar. It's a bottle. Oh my gosh. I could so incorporate that with my Panthers. Can I get off the tequila label? Because I don't like promoting alcohol too much. Oh, that is so cool. That, that might be what, how I treat myself. That's a more reasonable price. Look at it. Very unique. I might treat myself. Sorry for tapping. That might be it right there, how I treat myself. Okay, it's gone. She's taking it up front for me. The cheapest price I saw on that was eighty dollars. Most people have them listed for a hundred and fifty to three hundred. Not saying they're worth that much, but let's just say average price is a hundred and fifty. I'm gonna go ahead and get that for myself. It was super cool. I'll put that in the Panther collection. Some amber. <laughs> Nazi handmade lover's heart. Wow. That's weird. I don't know what to say about that. I don't know what to say about that. Okay, I, you know what? I don't even want to. These are cool. 47, 47. Little carved, and it still has the crystal on the back. Okay, and some different type stuff. Okay, I'm gonna flip around over here, you guys, to the other side. 30% off. Russ berries. Kind of annually looking, but they're not. Those are Russ. Okay, 
just a unusual collection. Somebody's resin art. Five dollars each. I just like the old school acrylic and uh, lucite better. Pretty rocks. Oh, I love that. 150. Look at that little Casper tank. It reminds me of Tank Girl. Lori Petty. Oh my gosh, that's old school, you guys. That's retro. Tank Girl. Who loves Tank Girl? It's a cult classic movie. Hey, if you haven't seen that, put that on your agenda. If you don't mind a little bit of re irreverent and chaotic, but come on now. Lori Petty was at her finest in that. It's so good. What do we have up here? Weller, Van Briggle, Roseville. Twenty-five percent off everything. Out of my wheelhouse. They're expensive though. Fifty, seventy-five. So it must be something. Let me find something. Oh, what's that? Sailor Moon type stuff? These are new. $15. Yosh, Yoshna? Okay, don't even get me started. Anime Girls. Sailor Moon. I think I do recognize a Sailor Moon in the back. Newer stuff, but very collectible. There's a Kate item. She loves that risque stuff for her bathroom, I guess. I haven't seen it. I hope to someday. <laughs> I hope to make it out that way someday. Now all of these, that's that new stuff that you see all over whatnot. Those pins there are the new stuff. Mass produced coming out of China. Don't ever pay too much. They have their reasonably priced. Two for eight dollars. Yes, that's right. So, because they only cost about two or three dollars a piece. Maybe more if it's elaborate. But if you buy bulk, see, so you get better prices. And when you guys see people selling those on whatnot, be careful. Make them show you the back and everything, and so you'll know that it's not vintage. Some of them are just vintage inspired. But I do sell these out of my booth. And uh, I think you guys have bought some of the fairies, and I've given some away or did them as $2 add ons. Okay, this is fun. Number 401 or 404. It's on the end cap, you guys. And the name is Chrysalis Studios. Someone's making some fun little assemblages, kind of things I'd like to do, not just like Christmas or Easter, you know. And she puts them in a, how do you say, collage? Collage, am I saying that right? Those domes. <laughs> Look at the dinosaur. And there's a nice little outdoor reading room. Got some crystal, butterfly, bird skull. Those are fun. They're not cheap though, you guys. I see 128. I see 205. Little tiny ones though, 18. Little baby boos. <laughs> Okay, that was fun. Oh, here's, I thought she was leaving. She's still here. She's doing the modern butts and bouquets. Now, the ones I have sold you guys were a special deal. It was a lady who um, salvaged a bunch of new old stock buttons. She just happened to be Colorado, too. Okay, who knows? Could have been this lady. So these are newer buttons, but she's doing a great job. Those are fun. Now, that looks like she took an old pen and upcycled the bottle looks somewhat older too that one's only twenty two dollars it just needs a smiley face in the middle but I just bought myself something and I'm pretty darn happy with it too and there are some stems that you can put in a vase okay I'm passing up like Hot Wheels a case full of knives Star Wars stuff but honorable mentions this looks like um, Polish pottery we have several booths that have Polish pottery, you guys. 
some vintage and some newer. There's a big crowd for that. So this is coming out of Colorado. She probably has um so again, just kind of passing up things that I don't really know much about. Clocks, yeah, watches, pocket knives, coins, car type stuff. I wouldn't even, you know, know what to say. <laughs> I've seen that before. Let's see what she's got down in here. I can't see prices to tell you guys, except the big cat, Siamese, is 25 But I love this vintage one. Look, the yellow one. Only 18 I do like that one. Newer collectibles. Lots and lots of that stuff. Lennox, a case full of Lennox. Knives, Funko. Macabre type stuff, or wait a minute, let me not use the word macabre. Let me say, um, oddities. Let me say that jewelry, jewelry, jewelry. Here's a piece of Raku, it's a different kind than what I collect with the crackle. It's pretty though. I've sold some of that and I've got some pending for here. Love these bracelets. Not bad. Look, 28, 26. This is, you know, it is coming out of most likely either Mexico or Indonesia type, Tibetan. The settings aren't too bad though. So those prices, those are fair enough prices. For you know what that is, it's a different kind of silver, most likely. So you want to be sure that's what you're looking for. It's probably going to be a different silver content. That's why it's a little bit more affordable. We'll wrap but still up with very, this. Very pretty. The teeniest, tiniest. I have such a good collection to have a petite. I mean, a super baby boo petite sale. I'm gonna have it with some of my friends. Let me see if I can get in on this for you guys. It might be high. It might be hard to isolate with your eyes, so let me try to hold steady. Four dollars, six dollars, five dollars, seven dollars. Let me see if that's a better view. Look at all of them, you guys. Let me see if my fingernail helps. Those are so tiny. Pretty cool earrings in the back. I'm gonna zoom in on this again. There's so much of it, it might be hard, but hang on, and I'll hold still. Those are fun. And that one is 25. That's about a five by six. Costume jewelry. Those little trinket jars are cute, but now they are newer, but they're pretty with the different colors, right? And I want to look at the dragon. I don't have a dragon. The dragon's 15. <laughs> and there again is some of the, are some of the newer pins. So she doesn't have a price too bad though. But just mom, you know what I'm saying be cautious but if you're just buying a one-off for yourself you know you save shipping so that makes it worth it all right you guys I think that's all for here today there's two more rows and I'll do that next time okay I hope you guys have a little fun and I'll see you on the next video bye bye